Hey y'all, it's me, I'm a new cut. Uh Yes, work. (laughs) So to get these beach waves, I'm going to start by parting off my hair. Now for these, we're ultimately going to have four sections. Just keep that in mind. If your hair is not as thick as this, you can honestly just do it with two sections. So for my cream, I'm using the Mayel Organics Twisting Souffle, one of my favorite stylers. And I'm just going to take my brush, smooth that through, you know the drill, and just start flat twisting. Now, again, I'm sorry, this is not a how to flat twist tutorial because... Just like braiding, I'm honestly not that great at flat twists either. I'm getting there though. But ultimately, if you know how to braid, you know how to flat twist. So just throw them bad boys in. At the end, I did just create a little bantu knot at the bottom of it just to secure that down. Since my hair is cut and it's a blank cut, my ends just don't stay together so that's one of the reasons why i did that but i do think it's helpful for everyone to just do a little bantu knot there to secure it and then i just did this same thing on the next sections and when i was done those two i actually went ahead and combined those twists and did just one big bantu knot And just went ahead and literally repeated the same exact thing to the other side. The very, very simple hairstyle, which was one of the reasons why I loved it. Because the results were really cute, but it really took nothing to achieve them. Now, if you can tell, my bantu knot on the other side did come apart. So what I decided to do was take the two twists and actually twist those two together and then create a bantu knot. By doing that, it stayed secure. Um, They did not come apart. So if your hair come apart like mine, try to do that. And I just repeated that on the other side. And this is how it looks. So it's now the next day and we're going to go ahead and take these twists out. I took some hair oil and just put that on my hands and just went ahead and undid the twist. Now I did take my pick and just picked out the back just a bit so that I can get rid of that part. But then I picked the sides a little bit as well to add some volume and this is how it came out. Super cute, I absolutely love this. So thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.